we can do this. No, no, I was supposed to stay up there. What's up dudes and dudettes? My name's Ezekiel and welcome back to Shovel Knight. So, where we last left off, we um, we uh, went through the Explodatorium and we started, uh, we went over to, um, well, we went as far as we could, uh, but now we, um, now we're confronted with this guy, who's, uh, he's a scientist, he throws a bunch of potions, and then he, uh, transforms into this big beast after throwing a bunch. But I don't have to worry about it because I killed him. So we move on. We hit the next checkpoint. We hit an apple. We're good. Now this is where the phase locket really comes in handy. But now I need to use the fishing rod. And it's just a trowel. I have both of my chalices full. I can't use it. So. Ooh. Alright. I hate this part. I have to deal with Jumpy McJumperson. Ouch. Alright. Here we go. Bop. There we go. Alright. I just really hate this room. This part's a pain. I have to deal with the dumb fairy. Oh, I got him. Alright, here we go. I need the uh, thing for this. You can do this without the phase locket, but. Oh boy. It is really difficult. Anyway, now I can break this wall and I can go in here. Here we go. You can also do this without the phase locker, but I'm bad at that too. Ouch. See? Ouch. But I got a lot of gold. And this room is just for the gold. Jump. Then walk. Alright. Then we go up. Alright, we kill them both. We go up more. We hit the apple. Okay, now I'm now I'm doing good. Alright. So Ouch, I should have waited. But now we're at the part where we have to face this guy. I wonder, what if I throw an alchemy coin? I guess not. Come on. Come on, there we go. Third time's a charm. Let's get a carrot. Let's move on. So then we gotta face more of these guys. It's okay, because they, they give me money. Alchemy coin is really useful, actually. I haven't used it this much, like, ever. Wow. No, I didn't mean to throw it at that piece of dirt. Alright, here we go. Alright. So as you can see, there's a chunk of ore in the wall, and we can break that to get gold. Or, we can do this. No, no, I was supposed to stay up there. Oh no. Dang it. Come on, come on down. All right, we got hurt, but we made it. Now let's go over here. Let's try not to get hit by the spider's potions. Let's kill that guy. Alright. 
Come on. Alchemy token. It only bounced off him? Wow. Like, I didn't know some enemies were powerful enough to resist it, but we are just about at the end of the level anyway, so let me fish for this down here. Let's grab the goldfish and let's move on. And now we face Plague Knight, who is one of my favorite uh, enemies of the whole game. So I, I doubt these will do us any good. Um, I think the best thing is just to use the phase locket and hope for the best. Gee, leave me alone. Show yourself, Plague Knight. Your trickery will not stop me. Trickery? <laughs> the fruits of my research and know me a trick. Boom! <laughs> Now let's have a lesson, shall we? I promise, <laughs> it'll be enlightening! And now, we get a little insight into the powers of Plague Knight that you'll uh, see in uh, the Plague Knight uh, campaign, Plague of Shadows. Um... Which, as I've probably said before, is just the same levels and stuff as uh, Shovel Knight, but like, like the stories coexist at the same time and it's really cool. Alright, hold on. I need to... Let me drink my Tropal Chalice of Health. Yeah, took him down, easily. So there we go. Easy win. And uh, now I've got a bunch more money. And of course, just the sleeping by the fire. It's normal for, for Shovel Knight. But now I need to wake up. I need to dig in the ground. And now I've, you know, beaten the Explodatorium, but then there's this guy blocking the way to the village. So let's take him out real quick, shall we? North from Pridemoor, west at the Fork. Oh, bother. I must have passed it already. Rize is an interesting character. I, I really like him. Well met, Traveler. Oi, maybe you can help me. I think I got lost. I was trying to... Wait a second. You're the knight with a shovel. Indeed, I am the knight with a shovel who has been menacing the village. I I assure you I have done no such. You gonna use that shovel to bury innocent people? The reign of terror ends here. So, as you can see, he's a little confused. Ouch. Alright, so we're gonna, we're just gonna slash him and hop on him, ouch. Yeah, let's drink my uh, Chalice of Invincibility, my Icor of Boldness. Uh oh. Well, we got rid of most of the fire, so that's good. Alright, we are winning. One more hit will kill him. Boop, there we go. So, beat him. Do your worst, villain. Strike me down. I'm no villain, we're fighting a common enemy. Yeah, the thing is, he like, he's a hero in training. He does not know uh, who's good and who's bad. He gets confused easily, but. We, we are? Why didn't you say so? Well, I feel like a fool now. Think nothing of it, friend. Knights are strongest when they work together. 
Yeah, Knight's Code First Vow. Always help a person in need. Knock him down, Shovel Knight. So I gained a friend, I got some gold, and a music note. Anyway, let's refill my Trouple Chalices. Um, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to get double health. So we got those. Oh, uh, I know you've seen this before. I, um, forgot to do it when I, uh, replayed the thing. So, there we go. Anyway, now I gotta return these music sheets. Because the bard's been missing them. Oh, there we go. I just gave him four music sheets. <laughs> it's 2,000 gold. So now I've got quite a lot of gold to spend. Uh, let's see. Can I spend any of it on magic? Yeah, I can. Here we go. How much for more magic? No, I'm not gonna pay that much right now. I'll, I'll get more later. Uh, in any case... I'm gonna exit the village here. And, uh, that's where I'm going to have to end it because I'm all out of time for this episode. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. And if you have, hit that like button or leave me a comment down below. And as always, I will see you dudes and dudettes in the next video. But until then, Zekiel out. Oh, my God.